I'm hoping somebody can help me understand Yelp because I'm getting really frustrated with them and I'm beginning to think that if you pay them enough money, they will make it impossible for people to post negative reviews of companies that are seriously earning them, such as DC Heating and Air Conditioning here in South Orange County. Now, I have posted my review several times, several times, and I keep getting the same message from Yelp feedback, which, hello, you can't reach these people. There's no email back. My, uh, my review reads, I contacted DC Plumbing and Heating and Air Conditioning, Inc. to replace the water line valve used in our swimming pool. Rod quoted me $150 to remove and replace the faulty valve, but did not have the correct replacement part in his van. So he placed a temporary valve on the line and promised to return the next day with the correct replacement valve. I cut a check for $150. I gave it to Rod before he left. He did not return the next day or the next or the next. Eight days later, Rod returned stoned out of his mind. The smell of cannabis was overpowering with the correct part and proceeded to try and charge an additional $300 to have the correct valve installed. When I quoted what he when I quoted what he said to me on his initial visit, he claimed I misunderstood him, but I did not. I would never agree to pay $450 for a $40 part to be installed. I refused to pay and uh, ordered him off the property. The valve was subsequently uh, replaced by my pool man for $15. Avoid DC Plumbing, uh, Heating, and Air Conditioning, Inc. They are dishonest. And I will repost this review a thousand times until Yelp recognizes its mine and ceases removing it. No company has ever angered me more than this messed up plumbing service. That's my review. And I keep getting the same message back from feedback at Yelp.com, which you cannot reply to, saying, we wanted to let you know we removed your review of DC plumbing, heating, and air conditioning. Our support team has determined that it falls outside the content guidelines because it does... Uh, because the content does not appear to be your own. Additionally, we are writing you again because you continue to post reviews of DC heating and air conditioning that fall outside the content guidelines, despite our previous warning. Please be aware that reposting content to this business page will result in closure of your account. Well, there's no way for me to find out what part of this they find objectionable. I've rewritten it 12 times and resubmitted it. It is factually true. And uh, there's, a, there's paperwork to show that they did, in fact, take a $150 payment from me. So can somebody tell me either how you get a hold of a live person at Yelp, because I have failed in that attempt every time, or how to get an answer out of them, what part of this they find objectionable. Because I am almost certain at this point they've done it so many times that DC Plumbing <laughs> is paying them to be an advertiser because their reviews are suddenly four star. And when I posted my review initially, they were much lower. So can somebody help me out and help me determine what uh, I do to get my review of DC heating and air conditioning, plumbing, heating and air conditioning to stick. Thank you.